Everyone, happy Tuesday, welcome back. Today, we are going to talk about the top three tips that I have for you so you can conquer distractions and finally get shit done. So thank you so much for joining me. If you haven't joined me before, my name is Carmen Olin. I'm a holistic nutritionist, personal empowerment coach, and transformational speaker. So what the hell does that mean? My work is really dedicated to guiding ambitious women just like you to get out of that never ending to-do list, create sustainable health habits, and just live the most awesome, energetic life possible. So that's it. So what you're gonna learn today is the three things that you can do today. We're talking about you can implement them right away to conquer your distractions and get shit done. Now at the end of this video, already parched, what the heck? At the end of this video, I'm gonna give you a little challenge. And if you do the challenge, you're gonna be entered to win a fun little get shit done prize pack personally from me that I will send to you. So this is not a tip about getting things done, but water, always water, make it your primary beverage. Not only will you have more energy, you'll actually like lose weight, your digestion will be better, like so many amazing things just from drinking water every day. Let's get in to those tips. So tip number one is get all of that to-do list that you have up here in the amazing brain that you have that's taking up so much space that's limiting you from all your creativity and driving you crazy, keeping you out of this moment right here and in the future of what you have to do. Get all of that stuff out of your head. So here's what I want you to do. It's something really simple called a brain dump. Get out a piece of paper and write everything that you have up here here on your to-do list. So this could be calling to make a dentist appointment for your kids. This could be getting the car washed. This could be um, planning a vacation. This could be to-do list at work. This could be deep cleaning your baseboards in your house. Whatever it is, like get all of that stuff out of there because what happens often when we have it just up here, it completely drains your energy. It also overwhelms you and it builds stress and anxiety in your life and you don't want any of that. You wanna live in the present moment and find joy in today. So do that brain dump. After you have that big list, I want you to go through it and see what really matters. Over the next three weeks, does it really matter if you clean your baseboards or could you maybe do that next month? Does it really matter if you make the dentist appointment? Is it overdue or can you do that next week? Really prioritize and really decide if it matters within the next three weeks. Cross off the things that you don't need to do right away. And now we're gonna go into number two to conquering your distractions and getting shit done. That is, here's what I want you to do each and every day. I want you to pick just one thing from that list, the most challenging, toughest thing, but the thing that you know that will move you forward the most, pick that one thing and I want you to do it first thing. First thing in the morning or first thing when you start your day, pick that one thing. And I know it's gonna be like, you wanna do so many more than just one thing. Then after you pick that one thing that moves you forward, that kind of like you have some resistance against, that maybe it might be kind of challenging or hard, then I want you to pick one thing from that list that brings you joy and fills you up. Then each day, I want you to do one hard thing and one thing that brings you joy and fills you up. Now what's gonna happen here is that you are gonna get so much shit done. Now you're asking yourself, but Carmen, usually I do like five things in one day. You probably don't. Realistically, you do a part of five things in one day, but you never actually complete one thing, so it still creates stress and anxiety in your life and you're not getting shit done. So try this. Just try this and see how it works. One hard thing and one thing that brings you joy. So step one was your brain dump. Prioritize that shit out. Push some shit over to the side that don't really matter, doesn't really matter. Good language today, huh? And then uh, the second thing is to pick one thing that challenges you every day to do, like do that first, get that done, cross it off your list, pick one thing that brings you joy and fills you up. Then lastly, I want you to batch work or work without distractions when you're doing these things. So what does that mean? There are so 
many distractions. It could be the phone, it could be text message alerts, it could be, oh, I'm just gonna look this up on my phone really quick, oops, I accidentally hit Instagram or Facebook and now I'm aimlessly scrolling through. Put your phone to the side, turn off all notifications, and set yourself a specific time. Now, everybody's a little bit different. I normally can work undistracted, uninterrupted for two hours at a time and be really, really, really productive. Other people, it might only be 30 minutes. Other people, it might be four hours. So figure out what's right for you and then set yourself a goal. I am going to work uninterrupted. I'm not going to check my phone. I'm not going to have my email notifications popping up on my computer. I'm not going to do anything except for this one thing. If there's people around you at work or at home, make sure you let them know, hey, I'm working on a really important project for the next two hours. Please do not disrupt me. So when you set that expectation ahead of time, then you're less likely to get interrupted. So that is the third thing. Do the batch working cut out all distractions. So for example, on my phone during the day, my ringer is off. The only notification that I have, which doesn't ding, it's only a visual cue, is my text messages. I don't have any email or any social media on my phone. And when I'm doing my batch working, I have my phone turned over. Um, the only thing that I would be doing with my phone, which I don't allow myself to change the song, is I like to turn on like a Sam Smith radio or something like that on Pandora. Pandora or a Spotify playlist and have that playing in the background while I'm doing my work. This is so important. So let's recap my top three tips for conquering your distractions and finally getting shit done. One, do your big, huge brain dump. Get that shit out of your head, onto paper, cross off that shit that doesn't matter, prioritize it out. Number two, Pick one thing every day to do that's hard and challenging but really moves the needle and pick one thing that fills you up and brings you joy. Do those two things, cross them off, and then the next day pick two more things in that exact same order and do them in that order. And the last thing is to cut off all distractions and batch work. So for the day, maybe the first one hour you are going to work on your big one thing that's gonna move the needle forward. Then you're gonna set 30 minutes to work on emails. Then you're gonna set an hour to do something, some sort of organizing. You see your batch working your day and really focusing on that one thing, you're going to get things done instead of just doing a part of five things and never finishing anything, feeling stressed, anxiety, and overwhelmed. This works, believe me, implement it. Okay, more water, and then the little challenge that I have for you. So the challenge is only gonna be for today. So if you've watched this video, what I want you to do is to share it onto your page and say one thing that you can do today to cut out distractions, conquer those distractions, and finally get shit done. Something that you're going to try, something very specific, and share that. So the reason why I want you to do that is because now you are gonna be held accountable to doing that because you are sharing it with everybody. And if you do that today, make sure to tag me in it and I will enter you to win and I will do a little drawing and um, the person that I draw, I will go ahead and send a fun little get shit done prize pack out to you. I'll just need your address. So I'll be sending you a message with that. So that's it for today. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me and I will see you tomorrow for another live video.